Hi there, and thank you for joining me today. Today I'm going to be talking about three healthy breads that are great for weight loss and have many other benefits as well. And I'll be talking about what to look out for when you're going to buy a loaf of bread. People ask me quite often whether bread is unhealthy or not. And too often bread is demonized because of its high carbohydrate levels and because uh, this is thought to cause spikes in blood sugar levels which certain breads do, of course. Regular bread also contains phytic acid, which is a known enzyme inhibitor. So what should we be looking for when we are looking to consume healthy bread? So not all bread is bad for you. In fact, breads with, made with whole organic grains with as few ingredients as possible are very, very healthy. The few ingredients that need to be in bread in order to make it into bread are the grain itself, water, salt, and either sourdough or yeast. These need to be in the bread. Now, when you find breads with these four ingredients, you're very lucky to have them in a shop near you. Also, there are some breads that have additional seeds added to them or a mixture of different types of whole grains as well. This is also okay but the main ingredients need to be those. You wanna watch out for E numbers. You don't want them in your bread and you wanna have really as few ingredients as possible. Now, these breads, when you consume such a bread with so few ingredients, they actually will not lead to weight gain or insulin or even leptin resistance, but will actually reduce your appetite and will provide you with a wealth of nutrients as well as fiber. So really, really great for you. If you find such bread loaves near you, you're lucky. If you don't, I'm gonna talk about three loaves that you most probably will have at a health food shop near you where you can purchase them and know that you are consuming something really nutritious. So the first bread is sprouted bread. Now a sprouted bread loaf is made from sprouted grains. These grains allow the proteins and carbohydrates in the grain to be broken down through the sprouting um, process, which actually reduces the amount of starch in the grain, and it also enhances their nutritional content. So you have more vitamins and minerals available to you. Sprouted grains also contain less gluten than non-sprouted grains, and also, the process of making the sprouted bread also involves the soaking of the bread, making it much, much easier to digest. And it also uh, allows the seeds to sprout, removing the phytic acid, which as I said, was an enzyme inhibitor. It is removed in this process of sprouting. So uh, according to studies, the, the sprouting actually enhances the digestibility of the grains and makes the nutrients more available to us. Once we remove the phytic acid, the nutrients, including iron, zinc, magnesium, and other nutrients that are found in the whole grain itself, are absorbed much more readily. So that's number one, sprouted bread loaves. They come in really, they're really, really tasty. And um, they're also full of moisture and really, really great when you spread on them some um, a nuts uh, spread, very, very delicious, really. It's, they really complement each other. Okay, so the second bread is bread from Mestemacher Company. Now, according to studies, whole grains, especially rye bread, several times a week reduces the risk for developing different types of cancer, including endometrial cancer as well. Now, Mestemacher loaves are made exclusively from organic rye whole grains and their loaves are, are baked only 100% natural ingredients. They're a German company and they're rich in fiber, they are wheat free, they're vegan and they are low fat as well, depending on which seeds are involved in the making of the bread. Now the baking process involves extremely high temperatures that actually pasteurize the bread, making it last and have a very long shelf life without any use or need for preservatives, which is great. So you, these, these loaves of bread can actually last for over a year on the shelf and they don't even need to be kept in the refrigerator. Although once you do open the package, you do want to refrigerate them and consume them within five days. Now there are seven types of uh, Mestemacher bread, uh, which are all organic. Some have sunflower seeds, some have flax seeds, 
Some have, have amaranth and quinoa. You can uh, choose and uh, variate your diet with these different types of breads. Now the third bread is actually such a simple bread that most of us think of it as really something not healthy and not nutritious, but this is all wrong. And it's actually matzah bread, whole grain matzah bread. It's uh, matzah bread is unleavened flat bread. It has no yeast or sourdough. It's actually made only from two ingredients, the whole grain itself, organic, and water, that's it. So what you're really eating is really the whole grain and it's a rich source of fiber and B vitamins. Um, also has a, a, some antioxidant vitamins, including um, manganese and selenium. It's also a great source of carbohydrates and fiber and it is completely fat free unlike the other breads, but this one is completely fat-free. And it also is very low calorie if you're into counting calorie, which I'm not really, uh, I'm quite against it, but it doesn't matter. Um, it really has, uh, I think maybe under 50 calories per matzah. Uh, and um, because it is rich in these, also the antioxidant vitamins that are contained within the wheat, they are protecting your cells from free radical damage as well. Now, one thing that also not many people think about is that chewing the matzah, it really does require a lot of chewing. So this chewing is actually very beneficial from the brain. It increases levels of BDNF, brain-derived neurotrophic factor, which is a brain growth factor that supports brain cell health and even neurogenesis, the production of new brain cells. So before you decide to completely remove bread from your diet, remember, that there are some breads that are actually very, very beneficial for you. They provide you with a lot of nutrients, they make you feel full, and they are excellent for diabetes, when you're watching your cholesterol, when you want to lose weight, and also for athletes. These breads are an excellent choice for your health. So thank you very much. If you like this content, give it a thumbs up. If you want, please subscribe to my channel for more information, weekly videos, and of course, visit my blog at www.thegorilladiet.com. Thank you very much.